If I had to choose an airplane to take into combat right now, today, it would be the F-18 ENF over everything else. If I had to fly a jet across the beach, this is the one that I would choose. This airplane will keep us as the sharpest tool in the nation's warfighting toolbox. The F-A-18 Super Hornet is the most capable tactical aircraft in service with the U.S. Navy today. The Super Hornet provides a significant improvement in capability and performance while setting the standard for design for reliability and maintainability. The highly reliable and highly maintainable F-A-18 Super Hornet is combat proven and combat ready. During the 1970s, the F-A-18 Hornet pioneered reliability and maintainability as key design requirements. This emphasis on R&M set a benchmark that other tactical airframe designers attempted to match throughout the remainder of the century. In the 1990s, the U.S. Navy and the Hornet industry team developed a new weapon system design, the F-A-18 Super Hornet, to carry the U.S. Navy's tactical requirements through 2030 and beyond. Its initial operational capability was established in 2001 and entered service with the U.S. Navy as the world's most capable tactical aircraft. It is a survivable combat-proven design with a high capacity for future technology growth. The F-A-18 Super Hornet has shown lower life cycle costs and higher readiness than any aircraft in the U.S. Navy inventory. The highly reliable and maintainable design, coupled with an innovative performance-based logistics support package, provides increased availability, low maintenance man hours, rapid turnaround times, minimal scheduled maintenance, ease of training, minimization of support equipment, and basing flexibility. The F-A-18 Super Hornet sets the R&M chinning bar to new levels while incorporating major capability upgrades that will enable network-centric operations and sets the stage for autonomic logistics. It is well suited to give you the edge to fight and survive far into the 21st century. The F-A-18 Super Hornet operates in a very rugged operational environment that requires long deployments away from support facilities. The Super Hornet's robust structural and systems design incorporates numerous features that offer high reliability, ease of maintenance, and a high degree of self-sufficiency. The Super Hornet is very stable at slow speed and structurally rugged to support the high sink rates and arrested landings required for operations aboard an aircraft carrier. This combination of slow approach speed and rugged airframe enables the Super Hornet to easily adapt to operations from expeditionary airstrips or highways. The Super Hornet's design for operation in a highly corrosive environment provides increased structural life and reduced maintenance requirements for land-based operators. The rugged structural and systems design minimizes maintenance man hours, reduces turnaround time, and maximizes aircraft availability. The Super Hornet was designed for autonomous operations, allowing pre-flight and takeoff without the need for support equipment. A single battery provides power for aircraft starting and is used to power essential systems during emergency situations. The auxiliary power unit and airframe mounted accessory drive provide onboard power for engine starting, hydraulic system operation, and fuel system operation, in addition to providing high pressure air to run the environmental control system during ground operations. The onboard oxygen generating system eliminates the need for liquid oxygen. Built-in avionics cooling fans provide cooling air when the air conditioning system is not available. A built-in ladder eliminates the need for a separate piece of support equipment. These features increase aircraft availability, aid in operations at remote airfields, reduce turnaround time, reduce support equipment, and reduce initial procurement and life cycle costs. The extensive use of built-in test, or BIT, provides fault detection and isolation at the component level to thousands of system parameters. This minimizes false alarms and virtually eliminates false removals, 
resulting in decreased support equipment requirements and improved turnaround times. The FA-18 Super Hornet's comprehensive bit allows avionics problems to be resolved in minutes by replacement of the faulty component. All critical avionics systems can be reached from the side of the aircraft and are located at chest level and only one component deep. No flight line support equipment or aircraft shutdown is required. The active electronically scanned array radar slides out from the nose barrel on rails to provide easy access to components. This feature saves manpower and is typical of the thoughtful design for maintenance incorporated in the Super Hornet. The ejection seat can be replaced with the canopy installed, eliminating the need for removing, reinstalling, and re-rigging the canopy. The FA-18 Super Hornet's digital flight controls require no mechanical rigging. Flight control rigging is performed electronically, dramatically reducing manpower requirements over manually rigged systems. The flight control system bit leads to increased capability and safety and results in substantial life cycle cost reduction. The F414 GE400 is the U.S. Navy's newest and most advanced production fighter engine. It incorporates state-of-the-art technology, modular design, reduced parts count, and a full authority digital engine controller. This provides the Super Hornet with a durable, reliable, and easy to maintain engine. The F414 engine can be changed in less than 30 minutes in the shadow of the aircraft without the need for raising the aircraft on jacks. Comprehensive bit, easy to access engine airframe interface points, electronic throttles, no engine trimming requirements, and quick access doors that remain attached to the aircraft make engine change fast and simple. The Super Hornet utilizes the 400 round 20 millimeter lightweight M61A2 gun. The gun is a palletized system, removed as a single unit. No bore sighting is required after initial installation. The gun can be rapidly reloaded through a quick access door. Ordnance or external fuel tanks can be mounted on a common pylon, providing a decreased logistics footprint and reduced life cycle cost and turnaround times. Maintenance man hour for flight hour is around uh, seven hours right now, what we're experiencing the air wing. So we're getting a lot of utility out of the airplane too. It's great having the, uh, the great capability of the airplane, but if it needs to spend a significant amount of time in the hangar bay being worked on, that utility isn't paying us any dividends. So it, it's like we're getting triple, quadruple the, uh, the dividends of the investments the Navy's made in the airplane. And uh, with all the extra room that the uh, Super Hornet has for growth, uh, it is going to be just as viable 20 years from now as it is today because it can, uh, can grow right into that. The, the biggest thing I've noticed is the, the ability to manage the maintenance. Uh, things just don't sneak up on us like, like they did with other platforms. We've got the lowest maintenance man hours per flight hour in any aircraft that I've ever seen in the Navy. And the bit system, being reliable, troubleshoots itself, i.e. it tells them the most likely cause of discrepancy. Obviously uh, very easy to maintain, a lot of thought went into these systems and the convenience of how to fix uh, different gripes. Uh, we don't see our airplanes down a lot on the roof. They're up almost all the time. A couple days ago out here at sea we had 10 airplanes on the roof and we flew all 10. Uh, I don't know that that's been done, in, in my career I've never seen that. I've never seen a squadron use a, uh, have a 10 airplane schedule on the uh, ship for cyclic ops. Perhaps somewhere there, but most impressive and, uh, and had an extra one in the bay waiting to come up if we needed it. Didn't need it all day. We just love the thing. The FA-18 Super Hornet is well suited to current and future demands of rigorous operations, rapid deployability, mission flexibility, and interoperability. The FA-18 Super Hornet's thoughtful design for reliability and maintainability gives it the edge to fight and survive far into the 21st century.